economic field or in political field, they have to work very, very hard. Just like in our country, the great leaders, Mahatma Gandhi, he had to work very, very hard. Twenty years in Durman, he spoiled his time, and thirty years in India, I shall say, spoiled his time. Uh, what for? For some political purpose. What is this political purpose? Now we are a group called by the name Indian. We must drive away the Englishmen and take the Supreme. This is what. So this is unnavilly. What is this part? Today you are Indian, tomorrow you may be something else. Tathadehantara prapti. You have to change your body. So what is the next body? Are you going to be again Indian? No guarantee. Even if you have got very much affection for India, uh, all right, according to your karma you will get body. Uh, if you get the Indian body of a tree, then you will stand up for five thousand years. What is the benefit? Uh, Krishna says, tathādehāntara prāti. He does not say that a human being is going to be again a human being. There is no guarantee. Some rascals, they say that once getting this human body, he does not degrade. No, that is not the fact. Uh, right. <coughs> the fact is, that out of eight million four hundred thousands of different species of life, according to your karma, you will get one. No guarantee that you are. And even if you get Indian body, who cares for this? So without Krishna consciousness, whatever austerities, penances we perform, it is simply useless to waste our time. It is not. Simply waste our time. Because we have to change the body, everything will be changed. We we'll have, we'll have come naked, you have to go naked. You cannot give. Mithu, sarva, harastra, hum, sarva, whatever you have acquired, everything will be taken away. Mithu, Vaishnava, Hiranyakasu. Hiranyakasu, whatever he has acquired, Prahlad Maharaj said, in the second you to come. So, my Lord, why you are offering me this material benediction? What is the value of it? I have seen my father simply by his eyebrows uh, twinkling, the demigods would be afraid. Such uh, money position, you have finished in a second. So what is the use of this material body? Uh, so uh, therefore those who are pure devotee, they do not aspire anything material. That is not there. Annavila chita sunnam jnana karma dharabhritam anukullena krishnana silanam bhakti yutta. You should always remember that. Don't bring any material desire in executing devotional service. Then it is not pure. Nasādhuvanne jatvātmano yam asannapi klesa dayātavya. As soon as you bring material desire, then you have wasted your time. Uh, because you will have to get a body. Your desire will be fulfilled. Krishna is so kind. Jīra thāvāṁ prapadyāṁ nāṁ kriyo vajāṁ. If you want to fulfill some desire by bhakti, Krishna is very kind. All right. 
but you have to take another body. Uh, and if you are pure, simply, taktāve aṁ punarjanmanaiti māmeti, really, uh, pure devotee. Uh, therefore we advise everyone <coughs> to become a pure devotee. Uh, pure devotee, this is the example of Mahābhāva. The five-year-old boy, he had no business except to satisfy, to become the pure devotee of Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama.